This is Akashvani, the news read by Abhishek Mukhopadhyay. Prime Minister Narendra Modi said the youth of the nation has benefited greatly by the reforms in the space sector. Addressing the nation in his Man Ki Baat program on Akashvani today, the Prime Minister said a lot is happening in the country which is strengthening the foundation of a developed Bharat. He said on the 23rd of this month, the countrymen celebrated the first National Space Day, marking the success of Chandrayaan-3. He said last year on this day, Chandrayaan-3 made a successful landing on the southern part of the moon at the Shiv Shakti point. He said India became the first nation in the world to achieve this accomplishment. During Man Ki Baat, Prime Minister Modi also interacted with a team from space tech startup Galaxy, which was launched by the alumni of IIT Madras. Mr. Modi said this year from the Red Fort, he had urged one lakh youth from non-political background to connect with the political system. He said it has garnered a tremendous response and a large number of youth are eagerly ready to enter politics. Speaking about the Har Ghar Tiranga campaign, the Prime Minister said at Riyasi in Jammu and Kashmir, a Tiranga rally bearing a 750 meter long national flag was taken out on the Chenab railway bridge, the tallest railway bridge in the world. Expressing pride, Mr. Modi said, whoever viewed these pictures, their hearts swelled with delight. On similar lines in other states of the country as well, people of all ages participated in such Tiranga Yatras. He added that Hargar Tiranga campaign over the entire country into a thread of togetherness and this is exactly what Ek Bharat Shrest Bharat is. Prime Minister Modi shared his thoughts on the bond of love between human beings and animals. The Prime Minister urged people to take part and catch the rain movement and also in the Ek Pair Mark and Arm campaign. On World Sanskrit Day, which was celebrated a few days ago, Mr. Modi said Vaitis Vidunas a professor in Lithuania has embarked upon a unique endeavor, Sanskrit on the rivers under which a group of people come together on the banks of the Neris River and perform recitation of the Vedas and the Gita there. In today's Man Ki Baat episode, Prime Minister Modi also touched upon the issue of fitness, its importance in the lives of people and listed out various initiatives government has taken to promote the cause. Mr. Modi said in a few days the Paralympics will commence in Paris and 140 crore Indians are cheering for the athletes and players of the country. He asked people to encourage the players with hashtag cheer for Bharat. Mr. Modi greeted people for the upcoming festivals of Janmashtami, Ganesh Chaturthi, Onam, Niladun Nabi and Telugu Bhasha Divas. Prime Minister Modi is participating in the Lakpati Didi Sammelan at Jalgao in Maharashtra. He will give certificates and felicitate 11 lakh new Lakpati Didis who recently became Lakpati during the third term of the NDA government. The Prime Minister is interacting with Lakpati Didis who are earning more than 1 lakh rupees per annum. In West Bengal, CBI conducted searches at 15 places this morning in connection with allegations of financial irregularities related to the RG Corp Medical College and Hospital case in Kolkata. A team of CBI is interrogating former principal of the medical college, Dr. Sandeep Ghosh, at his residence. Another team of CBI is questioning the new principal and the vice principal of RG Kaur Medical College. Besides, other CBI teams are interrogating Professor Dr. Devashis Shom, former hospital superintendent, and vice principal Dr. Sanjay Vashisht, and medical supplier Bipal Singh at their residences. And that is the end of this news bulletin.